Hey everyone, welcome to The Horror Show. I'm Cecil Laird, here to do just a quick video announcement for you guys, letting you know what is going on this Sunday, November 3rd at 3 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, and that is what I'm calling the Horror Show Painathon. Basically, it is a fundraiser for Dylan's New Nightmare, which is a not-for-profit fan film that we are making that uh, is currently funding on Indiegogo. So we are in the third week of the campaign and trying to kind of stimulate the, uh, the growth of the project. So what we have decided to do is a sort of our spin on a telethon. Now, we are not going to be raising money through YouTube. We are not gonna be using Super Chat. This is strictly for contributions that are going through the Indiegogo campaign, which I have access to on my phone. I get a notification so I can verify them. But what we are gonna be doing is, uh, first off, we're gonna be starting just for a bit of entertainment for everyone. We are going to be doing the Hot Ones, the official Hot Ones challenge, or at least, half of the official hot ones challenge which is i've got six sauces over here seven technically but six sauces from the hot ones tv show we did sort of an homage to it using the ass kicking wing challenge a long time ago but we're going to do the actual hot ones challenge so i'm going to show you the sauces we're using uh, this is the classic hot ones hot sauce from the show this is made by hot ones themselves so that'll be our starter sauce since it's theirs Next up, we've got a, I believe this is a four out of 10 on the hot scale. This is a jalapeno hot sauce, the heartbeat jalapeno hot sauce. The next one is I believe also a four out of 10. Uh, this says a three out of five, but this is the Bravado Spice Company pineapple and habanero. So that jalapeno one was from a previous season, but this and the classic are current. This one is also current. This is the other hot ones that is the medium this is the los calientes made by hot ones so that's going to be our midpoint then i've got a another habanero hot sauce which is called the aardvark uh secret aardvark uh, hot sauce which is the habanero hot sauce then we're making a bit of a jump from there both the los calientes and the aardvark are five out of ten then we are jumping to an 11 out of 10, which is the current, most recent, last dab iteration, which is the last dab triple X. So this is called the triple X because it's the hottest that they've ever had. They just did it for the first time on the show with Nick Offerman. Actually, as I record this, it just aired yesterday. But this one, it contains three of the different pepper X peppers, which are hotter than the Carolina Reaper. So that is that sauce. And then finally, I'm actually not sure if this, which one should be first, but we are going to be making a return to the Wicked hot sauce. This is a, a six plus million Scoville hot sauce. I think this one was like two point something. That's why I'm putting this at the end, even though this is still Reaper, this is Reaper extract. Um, they don't use extracts in any of their sauces. So this one's an extract, so it'll be hotter. So that is going to be the pinnacle. So that's going to be the hot ones challenge. So we're going to do that just to entertain everyone and see if we can stimulate some growth. If you do decide you want to donate at any point, the link will be in the description box. Again, do not do the super chat. I'll try and make sure that's apparent during the stream, but um, YouTube takes 30% of that. And the idea is when you guys contribute, you're not paying to have us do anything. You're actually paying to contribute to the project and you're going to be getting your perks just like every other contributor but there's going to be sort of a bonus perk where we eat hot stuff so after we do the hot ones challenge there are a number of other things that you can contribute to the campaign in order to have us attempt to consume so there's going to be six of us here doing this that night fuego myself and andrew from the show uh, matt uh, Heinz, who has been on the channel before, uh, also Robert Duell, who has been on the channel before, and then um, also Josh, the Wicked One, who made the song, uh, he's going to be here attempting as well. So there's going to be six of us doing this, and maybe even Josh's uh, wife, Sarah, as well, which would be great. Um, so hopefully that works out for both of them. If not, it'll just be the six of us, but I have other things for us to do. 
So people will be able to contribute and they can have us go ahead and try some ass kicking jelly beans. So like a handful's worth and these are habanero jelly beans. So we've got those. Uh, we've also got this one single solitary gummy pepper, which actually goes from jalapeno all the way up to Carolina Reaper. So we can basically make it three different segments. So it'll be a mild, a medium, and a hot, hot, hot pepper. So that's, uh, that's how we can break that up. There's also these right here, Packy Ghost Pepper Chips. So these are, I actually tried one the other day just to see how bad it was, and it took about five minutes for it to go away for me. So these are gonna be tough enough as it is, but there are a bunch of bags of this, so we can do numerous ones of these. Then to step it up, we actually also have three of the official Packy One Chip Challenge, which are the Carolina Reaper Chips. And this is the new version. This is version 2.0 of the One Chip Challenge. So that's why it's got the black packaging now instead of the red. But this is one single solitary Carolina Reaper dusted chip. And we've got three of those available for us to torture ourselves with. We also have, <coughs> courtesy of CP and Emily, the Death Nut Challenge. They were sent an extra one and they were willing to contribute it to us. So it got a little smushed in my luggage on the way back, but that is five different levels of, of nuts that get progressively hotter, starting at the Carolina Reaper, going all the way down to the death nut, which is hotter than the previous death nut challenge. This is also version 2.0. So we got the hotter version of each of them, including this is wicked hot 2.0. So we're, we have a lot of 2.0 hot stuff to, to go through. Also, we've got our hand on three toes of Satan. These are the hottest lollipop in the world. Carolina Reaper extract, if I'm not mistaken. And um, so we have three of these. The idea is to try and uh, hold one in your mouth for five minutes without uh, any assistance of any kind. So again, we're gonna be doing attempts. So people are going to be contributing to see us attempt it. And we're gonna give it an actual attempt. We're not gonna shortchange anyone but guys, it can't be a thing where like there's contributions that are then pulled back because we didn't get through the full five minutes. If we make an honest, valid attempt, which you know we will, then hopefully that's worth it enough. If not, then just, you know, don't bother contributing, uh, hoping that that might happen. We have one of these, which is Little Nitro, the world's hottest gummy bear. And this is again, Carolina Reaper extract made into one dense, little gummy bear and i am not looking forward to that i i think both this and the toe of satan are very cinnamony i'm guessing and i don't really like that at all so i don't know how that's gonna go then a little bit of an easier thing some some stuff that are a little bit more manageable price wise we're gonna have one of these we're gonna have one bowl of the world's hottest ramen noodles that you can contribute for each of us to take one bite of so it's going to be, there'll be actual bites, but it's not going to be for the whole bowl. It's going to be one bite. So it'll be a more manageable sort of contribution level, but I'm excited to try that. This is by Smokin' Ed Curry, the same guy that grows those peppers. So um, that is going to be definitely the hottest for sure. We also have Jurassic Inferno Jerky or Inferno Triple X Jurassic Jerky. It is Carolina Reaper infused jerky that um and and it even says uh the you know 1.5 ounce bag includes one carolina reaper pepper the hottest pepper in the world so they grind up one entire pepper and put it over one and a half ounces of jerky and that's that's what that is so we'll take pieces of that i found these really entertaining so i'm interested to actually try one if someone wants me to um that is carolina reaper infused cheese balls they're the hottest cheese balls in the world and they're no joke because it's Carolina Reaper powder, just like the uh, death nuts. So I'm not sure how that's going to go, but again, more manageable. Finally, the last thing we have, we have two of them and this is really interesting when you see it like next to everything else, but we have this, the world's hottest chocolate bar. So I actually just saw the tri channel, the people on the tri channel tried this and it freaked me out. I don't really want to do this anymore, but it's a little tiny chocolate bar that is segmented like a, like a, uh, you know, like a Hershey bar. 
and you can break off the tiniest thing and eat it and it's got again carolina reaper extract and uh it is a hellfire infused milk chocolate is what it says it's a flamethrower i got it from vat 19 but all of these things need to be handled with gloves apparently but that is everything that we have available for you guys to contribute to that campaign to have us you know as a bonus perk eat on camera for you guys so it's going to be a live perk generation thing but at the same time you're going to get all the perks for donating over at the campaign itself so you're still getting everything for donating to, to the not-for-profit film but the added perk of watching us eat terrible stuff on camera oh i'm not excited about it but i kind of am at the same time because i'm going to have back up there that i can pass the ball to i'm going to say right now that you can request someone specifically do it but that's not going to guarantee that person will do it because honestly, a lot of this stuff genuinely scares me. And if I get my anxiety up and I start to hyperventilate while my throat is burning, I'll feel like I'll never be able to breathe and I'll have a panic attack live on camera. So that won't be good. So I'll have to be careful about that. But honestly, if, if it's something that I don't feel like we can actually follow through with, I'll tell you before you contribute. So y'all can just comment. I want to contribute this. And I would like to see this and we'll take each one as it comes. But it's going to be a live paint-a-thon. Don't know how long it's going to go. We'll be answering questions. The idea of the Hot Ones segment is... The idea of Hot Ones is have people answer questions while eating hot sauce. So we will take one question per round from the audience for all of us to answer while we're eating. Um, so that way you guys get to see each of us try and answer a question while we're having burning hot mouths so it should be a fun time uh, again i don't know exactly how long it'll go <clears throat> just trying to raise some funds for the dylan's new nightmare project so thank you guys very much for watching check back in on sunday uh, we'll have our normal scheduled episodes between now and then but sunday 3 p.m pacific standard time 6 p.m eastern standard time and we're gonna have some fun with some guests eating some really hot stuff so thanks very much until next time i've been cecil laird and remember Stay scared, because I am. <laughs>